Hi, it's Dr. John Berardi here with Competitor.com, and today I'd like to talk about preventing dehydration. Of course, adequate fluid intake is an important part of any training regimen. Dehydration has been linked to breast cancer, colon cancer, urinary tract cancer, childhood and adolescent obesity, mitral valve prolapse, salivary gland disorders, and an ability to lose fat. So we all know how important fluid intake is, but I find many people confused about just how much they need. So let's turn to the science. According to the research, it appears that in sedentary men, the equivalent of about 12 cups of water per day are necessary to prevent dehydration. For women, it's about nine cups. Now about four cups comes from our food intake and one cup is produced internally through our own metabolic rate. So that leaves four to seven cups that must come from beverages each day. But remember, that's sedentary folks. As far as athletes, there's good research showing that a dehydration of 1% of body weight can seriously impair mood, intensity, strength, and endurance. So how much fluid do athletes need? Well, due to higher metabolic demands, as well as a higher sweat rate, athletes typically need to drink about eight cups of water on non-training days, and as much as 16 cups on training days, especially when living in warm climates. If you like metric, that's two liters per day on non-training days, and up to four liters per day on training days. Now, it's probably not a great idea to guzzle exclusively water, especially if you're training in hot climates. Due to electrolyte losses, hyponatremia is a real possibility. So make sure you're drinking some sort of dilute sports drink for your training beverage. The rest of the day, water's just fine. Just be sure to get enough. In the meantime, continue to eat well, train hard, and I'll see you next time on Eat and Run.